here's Mark Macias. He's the author of the book, Beat the Press. And uh, he's an expert on crisis communications. He joins the company now for more on what we can expect, 2 o'clock Eastern, Fox Business Network, when Tiger meets the press. Here's the question, Mark. How should Tiger Woods handle the media? How should he respond to the media if he wants to get sponsors back on board, paying him money to use his image? You know what? First of all, he has to be liked by everyone. Sponsors go out after athletes and everyone who is liked. They're not going to go after someone who is controversial, or at least that's where the big money is. All right. If he wants to get all the big names back, he needs to come out today and be honest. He needs to be vulnerable. He needs to humanize himself. He needs to let us see him as a person as well, opposed to being this quote star that we all see him but as. should he respond to questions what did you do with miss x does he do you it, really want him to respond honestly and in oh, detail you know Surely that not. you know that's where they always teach you walk around the question now he doesn't have his old uh, advisor you know that but um you know he, he needs to be honest as far as going into the details he can get away from that and I don't think he necessarily needs to tell us what exactly he did in bed or what, you know, was taking place. But I, I don't know a single married woman who likes him after this. I agree. And that's why he has a big challenge in front of him. I agree. I don't think it matters for uh, married women. I'm in his wheelhouse. 40, single, play a lot of golf. I'm the, I'm, all the advertisers are trying to attract me. Personally, if some reporter goes there with an agenda trying to attack Tiger Woods, if he snaps back at him and holds his ground... I applaud Tiger, and I'm more, and, apt, know, to, I'm more saying, apt to buy things that Tiger would push. You say he should not snap well, back at anyone. Well, you know, there's an old saying behind every great man is a great woman. I think there and are... And guess what? Evelyn's not showing up today at the Masters this week. That I, was just reported. Yeah. Really? I, He's not going. I didn't know that, but his, <laughs> it's going to be... It's even more uphill now after hearing that. What, but, what is up after hearing that? Nobody cares if Elon is there or not. No, are you kidding? It's fake if Elon's I just, there. I just said because he said behind every... No, I'm, I agree with you. It doesn't matter. If, if, if I, Elon is there at his side, people see it as fake, just like they saw his first presser as fake. Fake, fake, fake. Secretly, and I think those who are not golf fans, if he comes out and fails then it kind of just supports the idea that behind every great man is a great woman. And, you know, they want him to fail. Like, look, look what happened to your guy, Tiger. You want to screw up? You know, look what happened. All right, let's ask the $64,000 question. Uh -oh. Tiger Woods used to make, what, $100 million a year. Let's give him that number, $100 million a year. Do you think he can ever get back to $100 million a year, whether he wins golf tournaments or loses golf tournaments, whether he makes up with Elin or not? Do you think he ever gets back? Ever is a long time. All right, over the next, next um, five over, years. Over the next five years, um... I think, it, will he make the money he made in the past? I think in 10 years, potentially. I can't predict the future. I think five years, it's, it's possible. But a lot depends on how he keeps his image. I mean, his image is everything. If he makes these mistakes again, then, you know, forget it. I don't it. think he gets back. Jim? I don't think he comes back, Jim, ever. At that level. The floor's yours. I think it's sad commentary on our culture, but five years from now, he'll be back at the top. And whether it's $100 million or $75 million... It, he'll be back he'll at be the, top the top next year, but yeah. he's not going to make $100 million. Well, oh, should I, be, I, yeah, what I should be the first that. thing out of his mouth at 2 o'clock Eastern today? What's the first sentence you think he should say? I would say, thank you for showing up. <laughs> Yeah. No, yeah, you know, be, the first thing out of his mind, out of his mouth coming out there, oh, that's a tough one. I would say, you know, thank you for showing up. And I would just speak from the heart. I would say, hey, you thing. know what? I hope that um, I hope that my return doesn't take, you know, doesn't distract from the rest of the wonderful players on the tour. I think he needs to be, you know, kind to the other players going out there that he doesn't take away from their their playing. Uh. Yeah. I know that sounds Brady Bunchish, but I, I think oh. that's... He hasn't taken away from their bank accounts. Well, that's really? sure. The other, play, the other a, players there are like, Tiger, thank you for coming back. Distraction. That's true. Be a distraction. And Distract poor, all you want. And, poor Phil and the ratings are going to go up. Poor Phil Mickelson, who's oh. done nothing since he's been gone, and now he's got to answer the to oh, Mickelson be... loves him coming back. This is the best thing that this ever is, happened to Phil Mickelson. Meanwhile, Tiger was gone. All right, everybody. Thank you very much indeed. Mark Messiah. We appreciate it.